and so okay i'm going to the studio now so this is what we have here um first off the shirt i want to use this is the shirt pretty much very old shirt so if it doesn't come out really well you can always run away <laughs> i just wait like as if it's for click then where's my other brush and i've got i've got my brushes really old brushes from like 300 level 400 level in uni that's like almost three years if no more i mean keep out if i like something i keep a lot so these are uh, what are they even called coats widths and newtons yeah this is size three this is size zero this is the size zero this is the size three yeah then these are the acrylic paints my friend the client i told you about got them so it's really great that i've, I've gotten paint that i could use and hopefully to remain no? <laughs> yeah that kind of thing. so this is black which is an acrylic black you see it negro de marte you know mars black sharp black is black you get the gist which one is a very popular company obviously because the brush is rinse on it and the paint is rinse on it and so then this is crimson it's red it's not like pepper red it's it's more like a a darker shade of red crimson it's almost like wine but it's not wine mm. that's why i'm working on the names of these colors you know i'm working on a really really relatable ebook where i'll be explaining your basic colors and how to use name them and whatnot so this is ultramarine blue ultramarine blue then this is white titanium white and this is obviously yellow cadmium yellow then these are the brushes that she got me these ones i got these ones i just showed to you just now oh that one just fell down this one i showed to you just now these ones are round head brushes and i i, I use them most times for my watercolor painting but i want to try to use it this time because i do not have she didn't get to we didn't get to buy round head smooth brushes so these ones will do i hope they don't spoil when i'm working with them so that i can have stuff to use for my painting at least for the meantime but she got me these flat head brushes but my only issue with them is they are very hard in their head very hard head but i'll try to work with them and i think this will, this will definitely influence how it is rendered how they look because they are hard and they are flat as opposed to this one that are round smooth and softer but let's see how they work i'm not trying to give any negative vibes so i'm really positive about this project then this is the acrylic medium this is the acrylic medium i think it's like literally the most important part of this and i think this is for making stuff stay i'm in between do i mix it and i have two problems now that i have to solve first off is it that do i mix it i'm confused that do i mix because when you want to paint you mix this and this you understand in any container but my i have two questions that i want to solve with this practice i'm practicing the first question is when i finish painting when i mix because the paint is white the paint is white it's white in color as you can see It's almost like having white paint then when you mix it you're trying to mix it because the idea is to mix it with mix this with this but most times when you mix it, like for the shoe i made let me show you my shoe painted my shoe i've worn it like twice and look really good yeah yeah do that kind of thing when i painted the shoe the black mixing it it was more gray than black so i'm really really concerned
I'm really really concerned if I will mix it directly or will apply it first before the medium. I'm really I'm not yet very used to how to work with the acrylic with the medium but I'll get used to it and I, I, I know that I will hack it as time goes on and my second question is when I apply it do I need to iron it out to make it stay to make it out here those are two basic questions I am um, I have basically because the different kinds of medium videos I watched are different methods different medium types and the one I got the one she got for me is this one so I, I've, I've not really seen this type in any of the videos so I think I will learn on the job so like I said this is the shirt and I do not know what design I have in mind yet I most likely plan on just doing something really, really abstract and simple in front of the shirt and the colors I have in mind is yellow yellow and probably white yellow yellow and maybe green yellow and maybe light green yeah just two colors I thought I would use yellow and white light green so we'll see when work has started